So, just another quick video about a new feature that's been added to the CDJ export part of Virtual DJ in the latest version, and that is 6839 at the time of this recording. And a new feature is memory points or memory cue points, whatever you want to call them. <clears throat> but let's first look at the CDJ export feature a little bit so we can all remember that, what that is. Well, that's all about uh, preparing USB sticks, as it says here, in order to play them on standalone CDJ players. It'll also work on XDJ players and XDJ controllers and stuff like that, as long as it's the same format. So uh, Virtual DJ can now do that, or oh, it's been able to do it for about a year, so you don't ever need to use record box anymore. Uh, so let me just uh, do that uh, with a couple of tracks to let us prepare us to look at the new feature. So I just drop them on here. On here. Oh, sorry, I have to pick the right one first. I drop them on, and then it asks me if I want stem separation, because uh, CDJs can do that. But Virtual DJ can, so it can just uh, so you can get, for instance, the acapella track as well. So yeah, let me do that. So it'll then load the two tracks. While we wait for that, we can just try looking at the tracks by adding it to the regular decks here. So as you can see, uh, this track has three cue points, uh, which you can also see up here, and this track over here has two cue points, which you can also see up here. So they have the hot cues here. Those are hot cues, right? So uh, those are ready to be used and should also be exported so they can be used on the CDJ players. So let's just wait for a few more seconds until this is ready. Like that. Now it's ready. So we'll just shut down the DJ for a little while. Well, because I don't own a, uh, a CDJ, I'm, I'm going to use Recordbox to verify this stuff. So I'm over to Recordbox 6. And I'm not using that too regularly, so you probably ask me if I want to update something or synchronize something or whatever. Let's see what it says. Yes? No, I don't want to update. No, I don't want to synchronize anything. That's fine. And then now, when I look at the CDJ down here and look at all tracks, you can see here are the two tracks that we've exported and two extra tracks with the acapella versions because Visual DJ have separated that for us. So let me just uh, load one of those tracks up here. And now you can see that it has uh, hot cues, uh, the same three hot cues as we had before. And of course, if I load the acapella version instead, it'll be exactly the same. It'll just be only uh, the vocals that are on here, right? Okay, here comes the new feature then. Memory points or memory cue points. What are those? Well, those are actually a bit of a leftover from old times uh, with, uh, with Pioneer, but some people still use these. So if I look at, for instance, this old uh, CDJ 1000, which came out maybe 15 years ago, you can see that it, it did have the three on, only three hot cues. So that was not a lot. So it also had additional memory cues, which are kind of hidden up here. So they were used for other things where you didn't need the music to start at, at instantly when you clicked it, just as part of a, a part of a, uh, a memory function. So, uh, this is an interesting point. So you could jump to it, or you can you could uh, start a loop based on it and stuff like that. So that those are the old memory points. But some people still use them. And as you can see, if I switch here uh, to a CDJ three thousand, which is the latest uh, player from uh, Pioneer. It, of course, has a lot of hot cues now, but it also has this little, little memory thing down here. So memory points still exist in the Pioneer world. So that was a request if Virtual DJ could work with memory points as well. Because if I go back to here, you can see if I switch up here, so I don't want to look at hot cues, I want to look at memory cues down here. There aren't any. So uh, Virtual DJ hasn't put any other in there, of course, but because it's not really a Virtual DJ thing. But based on the request, it's now possible. So let me just shut down a uh, record box again and go uh, over here and actually uh, reformat my, uh, my drive because we want to start over. I could, of course, uh, delete in Virtual DJ, but let's just start over. So I'll just reformat my USB drive here. Takes a little while. Like that. And now it's totally clean. So we can start over. And I'll open Virtual DJ again. And now it's time to look at the new feature. So if I go in here uh, in options and I search for memory, 
All right. You can see it now has the CDJ export queues as memory points. So I said that's a yes. And now the idea is, as you can also read uh, down below, is that now the hot queues gets exported as memory queues as well. The hot queues are still going to be there because we need those two, right? But it's also going to be memory queues. So if you prepare to work, uh, prefer to work with memory queues on your CDJs, that'll also work. So we'll simply get the the two same tracks. This time we don't need the acapella version, so it'll be a little bit faster. And we'll wait for them to load here. So the USB drive. And now they should indeed have the three and the two hotkeys, but they should also have the similar three plus two memory queues. So let me just shut down the DJ again. And go back to record box. So that's low. There we go. No, no update. No sync. Don't do anything. And I look down here at the uh, CDJ USB stick again. I can now go into all tracks, of course. This time I was only going to do two of them. And now if I load the first track here on deck one, you can see you still have the three hot cues, of course, at zero uh, and at 16 and at three seconds. But now if I go into the memory queue, they're also there as, as memory queue or memory points or whatever you want to call them. So at two and three and 16. So with that feature, it's now possible to get the, your hot cues in virtual DJ exported as both hot cues and memory cues when you export to uh, CDJ USB sticks to, to be used at uh, standalone hardware by Pioneer.